Apple rumors talk about an iPhone 5S in colors. Leaked photos show us a probable LG Nexus 5. And if you thought the Samsung Galaxy Gear was a phone, well, not necessarily. I'm Jaime Rivera, and I wonder if Samsung's next refrigerator will also carry the Galaxy name? This is Pocket Now Daily. Today, everything is going to be about rumors, everyone. Let's start with Nose Phone, as we remember the Nokia Lumia 825 reports of their probable phablet to come in the future. Well, apparently this will bring the 5.2-inch display that we talked about, 1080p display as well, which would require GDR3, the Windows Phone update that we're waiting for as well. But aside from that, the interesting news here is number one, a polycarbonate chassis, and aside from that, a 20 megapixel camera. So uh, let's see if there's some peer-reviewed technology here. Stay tuned for that. And speaking of Windows Phone, let's talk about HTC as the company is apparently working according to credible sources on a Windows Phone variant of the HTC One. As it turns out, the reason why it's not launched yet is because they're waiting for GDR3 in order to bring the same specifications that we currently know on the Android variant, the same 1080p display, the same processor, etc. It just begs to wonder when we're getting this phone or the software update as well. But on the negative side, apparently the company is getting divorced with Beats Audio or the other way around actually. Apparently Beats doesn't find it to be a good business or according to analysts that's probably going to be the case so stay tuned these are just rumors by the way now let's talk about LG and Google's Nexus program apparently we have the first leaked photograph of the future LG Nexus whatever apparently it's going to be the five and we've got some good news here everywhere first of all you don't get the back buttons of the G2 and second of all you get a replaceable back so apparently we are getting a replaceable battery thing we hated about the Nexus 4 so links in the description for full details on this phone, let's see how it goes. Now on the sad side of the rumors, we've got some more credible reports on the Samsung Galaxy Gear, you know, that smartwatch that we're waiting for. And apparently, well, this is not going to be a phone. Apparently, it'll be another parasite to your smartphone as Google Glasses, which we know brings a lot of technical limitations, like the fact that you need a tethering plan to actually be able to use that thing. So let's see how Samsung pulls this whole smartwatch concept off, though I don't believe it'll be anything different to the current smartwatch we already know from Sony. And finally, for the hot and not so hot news of the day, we've got Apple in a combo of three here. First of all, the iPhone 5S will apparently bring more colors than we know. That golden iPhone that we saw is apparently just the tip of the iceberg. On the other hand, iOS 7 will apparently be delayed for the iPad models, just as it was on the beta. Links in the description for details on that. And as it turns out, we get more fingerprint scanning rumors. But anyways, that leads me to the question of the day. Would you like color in your iPhone or any phone that you have? Is it something you actually look for? In my particular case, honestly, I stick to white or black because cases just make everything better, but leave us a comment down below. How do you prefer your phone? Of course, as always, for an earlier scoop of everything that's happening in the smartphone and tablet world, make sure you follow us on PocketNow.com and subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. You can also follow me on Twitter at Jaime underscore Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. See you tomorrow.